Hello and good evening. I am C. N. Nidhi Bhaskar and I welcome you all to my channel. I am making this video to cover up the last minute exam tips for your upcoming ACC examination. For most of you, your exams are going to be there in the next few days. So, if I talk about the skill level papers, the last minute exam tips will cover up first which section should you attempt you need to pre decide that just don't go and randomly decide okay let me take up section a no it has to be pre decided now on what basis would you pre decide if i would have been in your place then i would have opted for section c to be done first now you will be surprised ma'am why i'll tell you two three reasons why i would have opted for section c first one in the initial one one and a half hours of your examination your brain is fresh you are not scared that answers are not coming or you are stuck in one or the other places that's the most crucial part of your examination section c is the only section where you actually are eligible for step marking that's another reason section c is the only section where you have to showcase your technical knowledge your presentation skills your knowledge about the topic your way of writing your way of anal analysis your way of interpretation everything you can't show that in section a and section b in section a and b if it is right it is right if it is wrong it is and even if it is wrong at the end or if it is a simple calculation mistake even then you get zero marks but in section c that's not the case there is another thing why i would have chosen section c first if by any chance you are running out of time and you are feeling that probably approximately 10 marks of paper you are going to leave because you do not have time it will help you in dealing with this time lapse also how if you are done with your section c first then those 10 marks of paper which you are ideally going to leave behind you can always do a trick on that just hit and trial mark a a a a in five questions that is 10 marks for section a and b mark a or b in all five at least one or two may be correct so that's just a tick mark at least the paper is attempted at least there are chances that you may pass but if it is section c you are not able to attempt it's not attempted at all there is no way out that you can attempt it no trick can work but that's my personal choice it's absolutely everyone's individual choice if they want to take up section a and b first because there are students whose strength is section a and b for them yes section a and b makes sense but tip number 2 ensure proper time management ensure that you complete your section a and b on time so that you can give proper time duration to sections tip number 3 even if you do not know anything in any section c questions suppose the question is actually bouncing back your head you don't know what to do in it at least you can identify which topic it relates to identify what all you can write on that identify what all calculations you can make in that question at least do that do not leave it just like that unattempted no the examiners are bound to give step marks do whatever you can don't leave the paper that's the biggest important the most important tip i always say the biggest advice which i can give to all the students please don't leave the paper sometimes what happens is students fail at a score of 48 49 and then they think oh it would have been much better if i would have attempted those 20 marks of paper which i deliberately left kar do usko you never know ek do number se you are just failing and then you suddenly come up as pass even if it is 50 pass is pass so even i appreciate 50 70 also are a great score for me 50 is also a great score for me i appreciate both these scores so 50 pe bhi pass hona is very crucial why not try for it 
नेक्स्ट टिप डू नॉट गेट स्केर्ड रिमेंबर वन थिंग इफ यू गेट स्केर्ड इट्स नॉट गोइंग टू बेनिफिट यू इन एनी वे तो डर के करना क्या है होगा क्या जब कुछ होगा ही नहीं तो डरना क्या आई सिंपली सी दिस हाँ इफ यू आर गेनिंग समथिंग बिकॉज ऑफ यूर फियर देन एब्सोल्यूटली गो फॉर इट बाय टू थ्री के जीज ऑफ फियर मोर फ्रॉम आउटसाइड शॉप्स इफ यू कैन डू दैट बट दैट्स नॉट गोइंग टू बेनिफिट यू इन एनी वे सो देर इज नो पॉइंट ऑफ गेटिंग अ फ्रेड ऑफ द पेपर हैंडल द पेपर कॉन्फिडेंटली जिस क्वेश्चन में जो याद आए डू राइट दैट डोंट लीव द पेपर हैंडल इट विदाउट फेयर एंड देन वी एज अ होल विल ऑल फील कॉन्फिडेंट दैट येस यू आर गोइंग टू पास एंड आई विल अगेन कम बैक टू कॉन्ग्रेचुलेट यू आई होप माई वीडियो विल फाइंड यू अ बिट इन अ मोटिवेशनल मूड बट स्टिल ट्रस्ट योर सेल्फ एंड अटेम द पेपर वेल थैंक यू सो मच टेक केयर एंड गुड लक फ्रॉम माई साइड Thank you